difficult decision of what to do with students in the fall. WBZ has learned that the state is looking at hiring outside vendors to handle some of the remote learning. WBZ's Bill Shields spoke with one mother frustrated by that news. Plymouth schools and parents are in the same boat as every other district. Come up with three options for learning in the coming year. Uh, the first option is to do a full face-to-face. -face. The second option is to do a hybrid model. And the third option is to do a, a remote learning uh, component. The Plymouth School Committee and administrators have now adopted a hybrid plan. Two days at school, three learning from home. But Betty Cavaco isn't happy with that hybrid plan. My kids want to go to school. Unfortunately, we have a medical issue that um, we can't take that chance right now. The problem is parents here and everywhere else don't have an option really once a school district decides. I do not have the opportunity for remote learning from our Plymouth public school teachers and that's a real big problem for me. But the state is now working on a plan that would hire private vendors to offer remote learning. They have to be educated. Um, that will be a partnership between um, this learning management uh, provider and the school district to be able to provide um, a remote learning option for our, for our kids. It's a very complicated issue and one with a lot of gray areas, but it seems the bottom line may be that educators and parents right now are navigating uncharted waters. I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News.